Singles Inferno, one of the hottest South Korean dating shows, is driving viewers mad with its finale and final matched couples. After a blasting time together, viewers have no choice than to think whether the Singles Inferno couples are still together or not. Undoubtedly, Singles Inferno Season 3 was the most intense season as compared to previous ones. Even though the previous seasons had their own unique set of members, this season, however, was a roller coaster ride of emotions. So, if you're one of those curious viewers who always seem to follow contestants' personal lives after a show finishes, don't worry, we've got you covered. So, without further ado, let's dive straight into the video. In the final episode of Singles Inferno, so much happened. From Min Young and Jin Suk getting back together to making a stone cold ice like Guan Hee cry, viewers went crazy. So, starting off with the rivals Minji and Hee Sun, who were both after Guan Hee, didn't seem to give up on him till the very last moment. During their last moments together, Minji took Guan Hee to her cabin in order to talk to him and persuade him to choose her. You guys might not believe it, but it was that moment when something inside Guan Hee snapped and he felt that he was the problem. The fun part is that Guan Hee finally admitted in the final episode that he's the problem, not the girls who were interested in him during his conversation with Hee Sun just before the final selection of partners at Inferno. Fans as well as judges were overjoyed to see Guan Hee finally admitting that he's the main problem and he was the decision maker. Then the same day, Guan Hee started weeping in front of everyone, not because he was never going to meet others after the show, but because he was exhausted from the constant pressure that he was carrying with him all along. And when the time of selection came, three girls including Hee Son, Hei Jong, and Min Ji walked up to him. To much surprise, Guan Hee openly announced that the person he would like to go to paradise is Hee Son. As for their relationship after Singles Inferno completed, Hee Son follows Guan Hee on Instagram, but he's keeping his following exclusive to only the official basketball niche. Recently, they were spotted enjoying a virtual ramen date, and Guan Hee spilled the tea, confirming they're getting along. He's playing it cool, not revealing too much, but hints at a connection. All contestants are in touch, but Guan Hee is extra careful about his bond with Hee Sun. Next off, we've got the most wholesome couple whose story is just like Cinderella and her prince. Well, we're talking about Si Eun and Min Woo, the fan favorite couple. Si Eun, despite being three years older than Min Woo, seemed to be quite comfortable with him. As the two of them couldn't go to paradise together due to bad timing, they had no clue about each other's ages. The three years old gap really surprised Si Eun a lot during the bonfire night. Si Eun and Min Woo's relationship status is currently a mystery, and fans are buzzing due to Min Woo's Instagram activity, where he shares fan edits of the couple, sparking speculation that they might still be an item. This couple earned positive remarks on Inferno, with sweet comments like, You look like a princess, and Then you're my prince. The romance may be under wraps, but hints suggest they could be going strong. Min Young and Jin Suk, the unofficially married couple of Singles Inferno, radiated serious couple vibes. From day one, Min Young chose Jin Suk, and their poolside PDA at Paradise was nothing short of cozy. Picture this, Min Young hitching a ride on Jin Suk's back as they swam together. Despite their on-screen chemistry, Min Young's Instagram is quiet about their relationship. The verdict on their current status is a bit tricky. However, in the final episode, Min Young sweetly thanked Jin Suk for taking care of her and even dropped a hint about wanting him to bake her bread in his bakery. Their time together was an actual inferno in the best way possible. Moving on, let's talk about the duo who got what they wished for, Yuri and Min Kyu. Yuri chose Min Kyu, convinced he was a dependable guy, as throughout the show he kept falling for Yuri only. As they bid farewell to Inferno, Min Kyu sweetly promised to shower her with an abundance of blueberry pies, ready to keep them coming until she couldn't indulge anymore. But the real time update on Yuri and Min Kyu's relationship? That's the million dollar question. Their Instagram accounts drop no hints, with no shared pictures or mutual follows. The status of their post show connection remains a mystery. Let's wait for some time and see if there's something special between them, or was it all just for show? As for the unfortunate contestants including Wan Ik, Habin, Hei Jung, and Minji that couldn't make it to paradise during the final episode, they all are well connected and are seen hanging out on each other's Instagram posts. It's great to see the contestants keeping their bonds outside of the show. With the most insane singles Inferno season coming to an end, what are your thoughts about the contestants? Let us know your favorite couple in the comments down below.